Hey, I'm Reed. This is Brad. We're talking today about NetApp disk shelves, and uh, we get inquiries all the time that uh, someone's got a filer or a controller, and they're trying to add more capacity, but they don't know what disk shelf they should add. So there's four disk shelves that we typically run into that customers are trying to add. The old, old disk drives are DS14, MK4s, and MK2s, mm -hmm. but most people have graduated to this newer uh, disk shelf. So the last shelf we're going to talk about is the 4486. 44, yeah, 4486. So you've got 48 drives and four U of space, um, and it supports uh, the same as um, it supports only SATA drives. Gotcha. So how is that different than when we talked about before that 24 drives that only supported SATA? Is that right? Uh, well, you're talking about different drive type. Okay. It's just a... Uh, that shelf's going to be phased out. Oh. It came first because they didn't have the smaller, fast SATA drives at the time. They just had the big boys. Oh, so the new one is more of a small form factor. Right. Uh, SATA driver, NL SAS drive. The old one was just the older, large form factor SATA drive. Correct. Gotcha. And that shelf is the DS4486. The new one is the 4486. Cool. So I hope that gives you a little bit of explanation. There's four disk shelves that are out right now, and you can use an upgrade. Just about every filer out there, uh, knowing the workload and your growth, as well as how much room you have in your data center, really will dictate what shelf you're going to pick, and uh, also the pricing perspective as well. So a new disk shelf is typically going to be about two or three times more expensive than a used disk shelf. So make sure you have a used strategy uh, when you upgrade your filers to get more capacity for less money. Thanks for watching the video.